deliver us from evil, short move you. Detective Ralph Sargi of NYPD does not believe in the supernatural. He just believes in putting bad guys behind bars. Man, that sounded corny. And he is dealing with a particularly nasty serial killer when things start getting inexplicable by any kind of natural law idea and he does find himself possibly needing a priest and it gets especially bad when he finds that his own family may be at risk. This is in a lot of ways similar to Scott Derrickson's earlier work Sinister but it's also not the same film. It doesn't feel like he just made the same film again. It does touch on several of the same themes and it's just about equally compelling. You really get into just you know, trying to find out what is going on and you want to see more of these characters. It's very much a character driven film. You really want to see more of Sarchi, of the, the, the priest whose name escapes me at the moment. The Sarchi's tough partner, Butler, who's like ex-military or something and he's just you know, it's Joe McHale, so you know it's going to be funny, but he's also actually really badass. And, yeah, the, the overall mystery, you really get into it. And it's, you know, the, the atmosphere is very carefully built and maintained. Very little and very specific sound, and very little light, pretty much consistently where, you know, there are these recurring sounds. So a very common one is the sound of scratching. And, you know, I, I say about Sinister that the movie pins you down and it keeps you in a chokehold for the duration of the movie. This is like that, not necessarily quite as much, but, yeah, you don't relax for the entire duration. You're just not always, you know, completely going out of it. If you like this review and one more detailed one, the link will be in the description box. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.